Morning, Joe. Katie, what are you doing? We're filming in 10 minutes. Get dressed. Da 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 Better? Almost. Perfect. I'm Katie Lynch, and this is Backstage Bite. Today, we have West Side Story, Cabaret, Showboat, Fiddler on the Roof, She Loves Me. How can we have all of these musicals in one show? Because we have Prince of Broadway, and Brianna Parham is joining us to cook up a delicious recipe. I can't wait for you to get to know her. Here comes Brianna! <gasps> for Sweeney Todd at Lincoln Center. The way aprons make me look snobbed. Oh no. I want to know everything about you. Okay. You've been in some killer musicals. I have. You. W I've been really lucky. I, I did Ragtime, then I did Porgy and Bess, and After Midnight, then I did Book of Mormon, and now I'm here at Prince of Broadway. So Girl. It's crazy. Yeah, I've been really lucky. Okay, but do you know what I really want to know about you? How much do you know about cooking and baking? So, <laughs> cooking, dinners, chicken, um, stuffed mushrooms, things like that, that's my thing. Ooh. Baking is not my thing. Great. You know what? We're actually baking today. No. Yeah, we are. In honor of Hal Prince, you are the liaison okay. of the Backstage Bite Loaf Time Achievement. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all are not well. I love time achievement. Yes! Also has feta and tomatoes. In Ooh, okay. It's going to be super yummy! Yay! And I think we should get started. I need Do it. four cups of flour, but this is a half a cup, so you so need eight to, of these? Eight of them. I, can... I do quick math. No, I don't. <laughs> Do you do quick math while you are telling me three things you would bring to a desert island? Oh, Jesus. My iPhone. But wait, do I have service? My straightener. My hair straightener? Is that weird? But really my hot comb. This is a lot. How dare you give me this long, narrow... Ooh, she's trying to sabotage me. You did it! Nah. Okay. No, with electricity, and this is a desert <laughs> island. Okay. Oh, I would take what my handmade tail book. Okay. Because I've been trying to finish it for two months. Oh, I read slow, y'all. So I will take my iPhone to listen okay. to music. Okay. Also, I would take my um, Brazilian tanner. Oh. Because I use tan accelerator. Because I'm just not black enough. Can you please do one tablespoon of sugar in the raw? Thank I you. will use one tablespoon of sugar in the raw. Bing, 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 bing. This is too fun. It's not right. Two teaspoons of salt, please. Okay. I was, normally, I would do this with my hands. It's, it's time, time to mix out. Yes. Yes. That was love it. it. Per. Yes. Per. I'm testing your cooking skills because you have to crack me some eggs. Done. And separate a yolk. But I need two full eggs in here and then one yolk. yolk. Can you tell me about the first time you met Hal Prince? It was my audition. Yeah. The first time you auditioned for he the show. He was in the room. He was Shut in the room. Up. Yes, and I remember that he didn't look up at all. And I said, okay, he hates me. And, and I sang Willie Like Me and he put his head up and goes, and he goes, that was beautiful. And I was just like, wow. This is that man I wrote a report about like years ago. <laughs> this is him. So then I sang cabaret and I literally go, okay. I go, I'm about to sing the shit out of this. You said that? Sometimes in auditions, I'm a little too much. And I sang cabaret and they were like, yes. And that, then I came for a call back and that was it. Were his glasses on people. his head? No, no. You well, know something the about those glasses is they're fake. Now they're real, now that he's 89, but when he first started wearing them, he put them on his head because he was balding and he was like, I need a distraction on top of my head. When he told us that, we were like, oh my God, that should be in the show. That's so amazing. Blow your mind. Now it's time for the most temperamental of all ingredients. One packet of yeast. One cup 
of warm water and okay. one packet of yeast. Okay. Keep it in the bowl. We're gonna keep it in the bowl. Keep it in the bowl. I need one cup of vegetable oil. Do I put this in here? Yes. When you go to the grocery store, yes. what are your three staples that you always buy? First off, don't go to the grocery store, but it delivered. <laughs> My three favorite things are spinach, because I am anemic and I have to have food full of iron, um, almond milk, Beets are huge for me because I love beet juices. Oh, <laughs> coconut bliss ice cream too. Now, madam. Yes. Can you please add your yeast to your entire mixture? Can I add my yeast? She can. <laughs> but we're gonna do it on slow, like low. Very slow and low, you guys. If there was a musical about your life right now, what would it be called? What would be the 11 o'clock number? Oh, who would play you? Heartbreak. Or the musical? Sounds morbid, but see, it ties in because my mom had, she had two heart transplants. So hearts are like a big thing in my life. But it would be beautiful and like uplifting. It would be okay. about faith and hope. Who's gonna play me? Sonal <laughs> no, yeah. Lathan is gonna play me. What would the 11 o'clock number be called? Joy in the morning. It would be called Joy in the morning. Nice. You'd start out solo with one single spot, and then you would pan out and there would be a huge gospel choir behind us. Oh, coming to Broadway in 2020. Yeah, yeah maybe sooner, so. <laughs> <laughs> I want you to take this out and start punching it. Bam! Right, we're gonna knead your dough a little bit. We got a little in our hands like they do in Jeanette. Oh, you guys just extended. What will you take away from the show? After this, I'm gonna have a, it will actually set in what just happened, mm. you know? And yeah. I'll, I'll be so grateful for this experience. I'm, I'll never forget that feeling of, you know, coming out and being Black Sally Bowles. It's so exciting. Oh. That spot hits and it is like, I'm living every 13 year old dream that I mm. had. And now I'm doing it on stage and they're paying me. It's amazing. Put down the knitting, the book and the broom. Time for a holiday. Life is a cabaret, old chum. Come to the cabaret. Fold, fold, and you're making just a nice you guys know I love oil. You gotta put your dough in. And with a warm, damp towel, you will cover your bowl and set it in a warm spot for an hour to let it rise. One hour later. Our bread has risen. Yeah. Kind of like how Prince's career. I gotta knead this again. <laughs> no. Oh god, this is why I don't bake. Mm -hmm. It's very messy. Ugh. Yeah, perfect. Boom. So does I. Okay. And spread it out into a rectangle. That's good. <laughs> I want you to do half a cup okay. of diced tomatoes. Okay. Try to keep your edges clear. Okay. okay. Now you are going mm -hmm. to do one cup of feta cheese. Oh man, this yeah. smells good. It smells so good. Uh, roll your dough. What? Think like of a loaf. Meat pie. And you're gonna roll. Can you describe your perfect meal for me? Ooh, cabbage rolls. <laughs> I'm so weird. What? <laughs> Stuffed cabbage rolls with like hamburger meat and tomatoes okay. and onions. Yes, and yes, yes. Oh. With some cornbread, with some honey butter on it. Mm. My mouth legitimately just watered. Wow. So I'd probably do coconut bliss ice cream. Okay. Or a chocolate brownie. A chocolate brownie with we coconut bliss have have ice cream on top. That's fierce. Now I want you to tuck your sides under. Ooh. I can make this. I can actually make this. I know. Okay. I think you. Brenna, so cute. Thank you. What's its name? <laughs> Broomhilda. <laughs> Love a spray, honey. Two little air slots. One, two. It's time for the egg wash, people. Yes. Because that heat is gonna bake it fiercely. <laughs> Put it in the oven. Put it in the oven. Bake it. Oh, 375 for 20 minutes and then you're gonna lower it to 350 wow. oh. for another 20 minutes. Then, this game is called Quick Fire Question. No! Ready, set, go. Roller coaster or water slide? Roller coaster. Loud or quiet? Loud. Favorite movie? Ah! Well, while you were sleeping. Snake or spider? Spider. Light side or dark side? Light. Up or down? Up. Instagram or Twitter? Instagram. What planet would you like to visit? Pluto. Crunchy or creamy peanut butter? Crunchy. What did you have for breakfast? I didn't. Sweet or salty? Salty. Karaoke go-to song? 
Ooh, Lauren Hill. Comedy or drama? Ooh, drama. Train, bus, or cab? Train. How do you take your coffee? Ooh, black with sugar and green. <laughs> First pet's name? <laughs> Chiba. That was so good! <laughs> Look at your breath. It's amazing. So far, it's going well. Oh! Okay. Yes. Boom. Hard. <gasps> but what? Bam. Bam. I didn't know. Isn't she lovely? Isn't she wonderful? Brace yourself. Tomato juice that soaks in tomato. Bread. But it's also the cheese. Uh -huh. mm. It's sinful. Honestly, sinful. Well, when you're done with your dance, mm -hmm. I would like to know how to follow you. Mm -hmm. Follow me on Twitter or Instagram. It's Brianna Marie. We are on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. Yes. Oh, at Backstage Bite. I'm really proud of you. Thank you so much. You're so I really appreciate it. This is not a performance to be missed. Holy Jamoli, Brianna Parham singing her face off. Go see Prince of Broadway. Yes, come see ah. us at the Samuel Friedman until October 29th. We've just been extended. Hey. Eight shows a week, people. Get on down. Rush, get your Today Ticks, or I can get your staff rate. Just call me. <laughs>